Hey guys, this is Zach from Stroke Gaming, and I'm here with a new, just like a thing where I play a game, pretty much. So yeah, I'm just gonna do this. New game. We'll start the first one. So I have played this game before, but not extensively. So I kind of know how to do this. That's some pretty awesome music there. Um, Hello, and again, welcome to the Aperture Science Computer Aided Enrichment Center. We hope your brief detention in the relaxation vault has been a pleasant one. Your specimen has been processed, and we are now ready to begin the test proper. Before we start, however, keep in mind that although fun and learning are the primary goals of all enrichment center activities, Serious injuries may occur for your own safety and the safety of others. Please refrain from Turn back. The portal will open in three, two, one. Whoa. This is weird. This is trippy. Sorry, radio. Well, I, I'm gonna keep him with me. Just be. <gasps> oh no. Are you okay? I think he's okay. Turn on the radio. Okay, good. I can keep the radio. Radio friend. I love him. Excellent. I love him. Please so proceed much. into the chamber lock after completing oh each no. test. First, however, note the incandescent particle field across the exit. This aperture science material events a patient grid will vaporize any unauthorized equipment that passes through it. For instance, the aperture science weighted storage cube. Please place the Whoa. weighted storage cube on the 1500 megawatt Aperture Science Heavy Duty Super Colliding Super Button. Oh god. What the heck? Wait, what? Oh. Oh, I get it now. Come on, open back up. Come on. So basically this game's like a puzzle game if you never played it. Oh, I have to wait again. Ah <sighs> man. You ready? Are we ready? Okay. So basically what we need to do is put this thing right here. Okay, so we get through this time. Perfect. And now all we have to Please do move quickly to the chamber lock as the effects of prolonged exposure to the button are not part of this test. Prolonged exposure to the button. What's so bad about the button? What do you have to tell me about it? Screen tearing. Oh man. Screen tearing is not fun. There's like a big line in the middle of my screen. Oh no. It's loading. Try not forget. Okay, there. So. You're doing what we very need to do. Well. 
Please be advised that a noticeable taste of blood is not part of any test protocol, but is an unintended side effect of the Aperture Science Material Emancipation Grip, which may, in semi-rare cases, emancipate dental fillings, crowns, tooth enamel, and teeth. Okay. So, okay, you're in there. So we have to get through here. Very good. You are now in possession of the Aperture Science handheld portal device. With it, you can create your own portals. These intradimensional gates have proven to be completely safe. The device, however, has not. Do not touch the operational end of the device. Do not look directly at the operational end of the device. Do not submerge the device in liquid, okay. even partially. Most importantly, under no circumstances should you I I won't break it right now, don't worry. Please proceed to the chamber lock. Mind the gap. Wait, what? Oh. So yeah, there. Well done. Remember, the aperture science bring your daughter to work day is the perfect time to have her tested. So we're going up. I can see. Because when it hits the wall, it goes down. What the heck? What's in the ceiling? What am I gonna Welcome get to test chamber, chamber four. You're doing quite well. Where's the orange portal? It's right there. So E E E E. Once again, excellent work. As part of our required test protocol, we will not monitor the next test chamber. You will be entirely on your own. Good luck. Okay. As part of a required test protocol, our previous statement suggesting that we would not monitor this chamber was an outright fabrication. Good job. As part of a required test protocol, we will stop enhancing the truth in three, two, one. super bright when you go up. Like when it loads, then that happens. So... While well, safety is one of many enrichment center goals, yeah. unbelievable. You, subject name here, must be the pride of subject hometown here. Make two parts to this. Part one is like the beginning. And then Warning devices are required on all mobile equipment. However, alarms and flashing hazard lights have been found to agitate the high energy pellet and have therefore been disabled for your safety. Good. 
Now use the aperture science unstationary scaffold to reach the chamber lock. Consequence for failure. Any contact with the chamber floor will result in an unsatisfactory mark on your official testing record, followed by death. Good luck. Second half of the thing. Can I use my? I've gotten the second half. I've done like three levels with it. I hope I get it on like level nine or ten. The enrichment center regrets to inform you that this next test is impossible. Make no attempt to solve it. The Enrichment Center apologizes for this clearly broken test chamber. Hey. Let's just... Take this and drop it. So Once again, the Enrichment Center us. offers its most fantastic... Okay. You remain resolute and resourceful in an atmosphere of extreme pessimism. Do you ever get out of this? Is this like 10? Yeah, after 10. Then we're gonna be done with this video. So yeah, my voice is a little over there. I sound like I was dumb. Hello again. Um, to reiterate, previous one. Whoa. Momentum. So wait, we need to. Okay, yeah, there. Okay. Ah. Dang it. Whoa. Spectacular. You appear have much to understand how it proton affects jump. forward momentum, or to be more precise, how it does not. A function of mass and velocity is conserved between portals. In layman's terms, speedy thing goes in, speedy thing comes out.
so that was 10. So yeah, guys, comment, like, subscribe, and as always, thanks for watching.